Hey guys, so I play StarCraft 2. I tend to play it almost every day. I love StarCraft 2. But this is something that Blizzard introduced in patch 3.0, and it's something that irritates the shit out of me. And it's that they use, um, when you click the top left corner, um, it shows the StarCraft 2 logo. When you click it, this is usually where you would see your background model. And your background model, and I will show you, you have background model and you have a choice. You have Artanis, planets, Kerrigan, and space clouds. So for me, um, and it shows you, the out of game menu screens, um, I like it to be Kerrigan. Um, and what it does is it normally shows the Dzerd version of Kerrigan, um, which you can see. It shows you that version of her, um, and she's just like basically in her um, hostile environment suit. The lights are pulsating through. She um, has uh, she can lift up this little ball and manipulate it, and then put it down and stuff. But it's it's pleasant to watch while I'm waiting for someone else to play with me or from like chatting away in the chat. Um, but the thing is, pre-patch 3.0, you used to just have it and it would just be there, you know, regardless of what you were selecting. Now when you select it, you have different, you have different backgrounds. So this is essentially what like a background would be considered where it's just, it moves around and does shit. Um, again, multiplayer and like the whatever. So the thing is, is that the background model that they usually have here, unfortunately, is used as an advertising platform. And what it is, is it's to advertise any special events that are happening for Blizzard or any new features that they release for the game. But the problem is, they won't allow you to take this off. So you're forced to um, see these screens whenever they see fit. And this is the third instance of this happening that I at least recognize. Um, so the first time they did this was with Patch 3.0, right when they released Patch 3.0, which was the launch of Legacy of the Void. Um, they happened to have a... Um, esports competition going on so what they use for this background is similar to this where it was just a solid image and it said learn more and when you go to click learn more it opens up a web browser and goes to whatever fucking thing they have um, the thing that sucks as I said it just it's one of those little things that just irritate me and and yeah it's not the end of the world but the point is, I paid for this game. I paid for every single version of StarCraft II, and I bought them pretty much on launch day. I have the collector's edition of Heart of the Swarm. I have the regular edition of Legacy of the Void. My uh, roommate has the collector's edition of Legacy of the Void. The uh, Wings of Liberty, I just bought a regular boxed copy of it. Um, but the thing is, like... The user interface for StarCraft II has seen many revisions. Um, my favorite revision happens to be Patch 2.0. Um, when they introduced the user interface for Heart of the Swarm, it was very well done. And as I said, it really introduced the whole background model thing where, again, you get just the animations and stuff. Um, and I've, I've actually submitted a, a bug report about this because I consider this a bug because... At the end of the day, if you're going to give me an option to pick, and it doesn't fucking matter which one you pick, like if you log out and you, you'll see one of these screens, um, as I said, it's just it's irritating when I want Kerrigan, it doesn't it doesn't give me Kerrigan, and and I just like Kerrigan. I think Kerrigan's a cool character. I think Kerrigan is, uh, you know, a badass. But th the problem is again, it just doesn't give me. Unless if I maybe if I change the region, I, I don't know, but it pisses me off that I can't have my Kerrigan whenever they decide it's fit for them to put an advertisement. So let me actually try with a different region. 
So it looks like when you change the region, I don't know if it deletes anything, but I've never played on a European server and I've never played on any of the others. But let's see, because I can't imagine them having these competitions, you know, like worldwide. They tend to just be regional. So, of course, since version patch 3.0, they've managed to make load times significantly longer. They used to not be this long. And again, like, if you see, this light here is the hard drive activity, which the hard drive, it's a separate drive. I use different drives for different things. But the hard drive is being slammed because of the new file format that they promised would increase load times and reduce errors and reduce frame drops and it's all a crock of shit. Um, and this, this is why I hate online only games where you know what if I like a game the way it is you know when you're an offline player and I don't fucking care and I'm going to quit the tutorial. Quit tutorial. Bring me back to my fucking shit. I want to see if do I? Yeah, see? So I can have my Kerrigan, apparently. So all I have to do is log into a European server, and I get my Kerrigan model back. But nope! See what it did? I had my Kerrigan model, and then it switches to this shit. So it doesn't matter what you have. It doesn't matter what region you have. It doesn't matter what background model you want. They they're gonna keep on forcing these fucking ads in your face and you know all I'm asking <laughs> all I'm asking for them is to have some sort of like button you can click like a little X or something that just dismisses this fucking thing that they put in your face so I can just have my Kerrigan background model you know call me like you know anal or whatever you wanna call me it's just a little thing that just irritates me because again you can't customize the the images here and look see European servers that are no actually I think that matters to this but like you know I I just want to have my my background model that's that's all I want and yeah I purchased the Nova packs and I guarantee you, when Nova comes out when they release those covert art packs they're gonna have a Nova screen here and it's just gonna be there and it doesn't fucking matter what version of the background model you pick it's just always going to be the the thing they want so you know I'm done with this video I just as I said it's just a little thing that irritates me and they do it all the time and I really wish Blizzard would just listen to me I'm a customer I've been a very loyal customer but you know please don't ever take away those background models as I said it's just a little detail that you know, I just, I prefer to have Kerrigan on my screen, that's all. And I can't even have that. So, take care, guys.